Hello, Joe Schmo here with the series on finding and renting your apartment. I've got some real good insider tips for you. This is going to be one of the most important ones to start off with. And I apologize, this video will be just a little bit longer than most of them, but it's, it's an important part. Uh, the first step when you're uh, looking for a new apartment is definitely the budgeting of it. Now for someone in, this, in the apartment industry, that budgeting word is almost a no-no. You won't find anyone that uses that word. Uh, one of the biggest deals, though, is, is figuring it out to start with. Uh, one of the reasons they won't ever use that word is they have a set price in mind. Uh, if you wanted to spend more than that, they want to talk you into saving money and only spending that. If you wanted to spend less than that, they want to talk you into, oh, this is a nice place, you want to spend that much. So the, it's very important before you start looking at all, even before you start looking online, figure out what you should definitely, what you should spend on the apartment. Uh, I'm basic guideline is never spend more than about two and a half times your your uh, monthly income on your monthly rent but there's two problems that can happen when you don't budget ahead of time and I see about 25 percent of the people that are shopping for apartments don't do this so it's important one problem that can happen is you go out you find a place you absolutely fall in love with it salesperson talks you into it and you end up spending more than you should have I've even seen people do this and end up being evicted a couple months later because they could not afford it. The other problem that can happen, and a lot of times people don't think about this, but what you can do is just because there's a couple of places at, at a lower price than other places are, uh, people end up choosing those just because they're a lower price when they could have afforded way more and they end up not being happy with the apartment they end up moving a, a year later and part of the whole object is finding a place that you like you don't have to you don't have to move every year so definitely look at budgeting ahead of time uh, might feel like a boring task or it might feel like I want to get going but definitely look at that first and then for more insider tips all you have to do is just let the next video start. I've got about five or six uh, big tips for you that will help you stay away from those crummy landlords. All right, happy hunting.